The basic background that Rakuk is responding to is the Chaye Adam, which we discussed in the previous uh, uh, Purim mm-hmm. episode we did. And also, you know, implicitly, all of the later Akronim who quote the Chaye Adam, including the Mr. Brewer and the Arach Shulchan, as we discussed, this caution from the Chaye Adam of whatever you might hold about drinking on Purim, remember, it doesn't overwrite any other mitzvah. If it's going to cause you to miss my river, you know, or any other mitzvah, don't do it. So, you know, whatever you might think about the sugya and what's shot in the sugya and how we should paskin between the Rishonim, like, but even if you think, like, the halacha is you're supposed to drink, you're supposed to get drunk, but, like, that's only if you could do it without forgetting any other mitzvah. If you're going to be too drunk to daven, like, forget it, don't drink. Mm-hmm. And Rav Cook really pushes back on that and says, well, wait a second, we have a principle in halacha, osek pa mitzvah, pater mina mitzvah. Mm-hmm. You know, if you're if you're involved in doing one mitzvah, you're exempt from doing other mitzvah. He says, look, if we hold that there's a mitzvah to drink on Purim, then if you miss out on another mitzvah because you were fulfilling the mitzvah drinking on Purim, so that's no big deal. On Purim, when there's a mitzvah to do it for the sake of the mitzvah, to get myself drunk, knowing that now I'm going to be an honest, I won't be able to dive in. Okay, that should be allowed. So says, Im kain, my time yeah, sir. mitzvah mitzad mitzvah de simcha, right? So, mm-hmm. said, right? so why should there be any prohibition to... Um, get yourself drunk knowing that you're going to miss this mitzvah derabanan of davening mariv when you're going to be filling, fulfilling the mitzvah derabanan of simcha purim. If you had to be super careful and not drink enough that you're not going to have the Gemara should have said so. And, and, right, his, <laughs> and, you know, and he says, you know, forget about, you know, forget about super drunk. Like we paskin, if you've had a ravine of wine, lechatzchila, you shouldn't daven. Mm-hmm. So, right, the Gemara never should have, the Gemara must have known that you know, people wouldn't be able to have, and it said it anyway. So and then, mm. and the, so clearly, clearly there's no issue. And he says that, therefore, I'm going to be, I'm going to be makil on the question of davening, which is really being machmer on, on Simchas Purim. Yeah. yeah. So I, there's a lot for me to love about this. And I think any, most listeners to this, I think are very sympathetic to ultimately his conclusion which I am as well, but I think what, I, and I'm curious to hear from you what you particularly enjoy about it, but what I l- actually really, really, really enjoy m- more than just the result is his process. Like, I love that he's actually, like, first of all, I love the just straightforward dry halakhic stuff. Like, that's, you know, that that sort of halakhic meat and potatoes. It's it's really wonderful. But I think even better is he's, uh, A, I, I really like the you know, like you're engaged in one sort of mitzvah. Okay. Sorry. You can't do tefillah right now. You're already, I'm, I'm busy with another mitzvah. Sorry, too bad. And like, that's totally, but I love what you just like, especially at the end of, if we even say a revise of wine, that sort of takes you out of ability to, to pray. So why was this even established in the first place? <laughs> like, and, and, you know, it, back in the Gemara, like, it's not like they didn't know what they were doing. So I, I really enjoy Sort of these just multiple, and, and it's also short, right? He's getting in so much within such a short, compact, it's like really efficient halachic writing. Yeah, I mean, what I really like about this is like the fact that he's willing to just, you know, push back on conventionalism. I love independent thinkers, you know, I love, so mm-hmm. I love the fact that he's not going to go the same trend as everyone else. And he's going to, you know, try and bring in another sogia and say, that, you know, there's mm-hmm. another way we could look at this. 